Okay, so I'm watching this video. Okay, right. Okay, now this has got me just a little riled up. It says, uh, YouTube video shows Texas judge beating, beating his daughter. So I am watching the video. You know, I'm listening to her scream and stuff like that. And I'm, you know, it, it really just takes me back. You know what I'm saying? It, it's so funny because I come from a household where you got a whooping if you did something wrong. You know what I'm saying? And I'm watching the video. And I, I posted down in the comments. I said, well, look, he's got a belt in his hand. He's whooping her on her behind and her legs. And she has on jeans. Um, what is the beating you know when i was young you know sometimes we got a little whooping when we were like you know we, we had on clothes or something like that but when i was young we got we had to strip down to our underwear to get a whooping you know what i'm saying you know <laughs> and i'm sorry people but you people would say oh i'm not gonna beat my kids you know oh that's just wrong i feel like i i i, I mean i have sat around with people and had long discussions and fond memories of getting a whooping as a child. I think mine stopped when I was like 12 when my mom passed. But I remember those times and I remember the things that I did to get those whoopings. There was a reason, there was a teaching that happened. Um, and it wasn't just like, oh, I'm just, you know, because I'm mad, I'm gonna whoop you. It was, you did something wrong, we are gonna punish you, and then you will think about it. Next time, possibly, I'll, you know, the child will say, Oh, before I do this, you know, oh, I, I might get a whooping if I do this. I'm not going to do this. You know what I'm saying? It, it's cause and effect. And for it, it's just, it's, and so a few of the comments, you know, it's not a whole lot of comments, but a few of the comments in the thing are like, oh, he should be, you know, beat up or, you know, he should be prosecuted or he should be, this is his child and he has chose to discipline his child this way. And. I'm sorry, you know, I ain't no Bible thumping all this good stuff all the time. But, you know, spare the rod, spoil the child. If you do not discipline your child, many times they do turn out, you know, not to have any discipline. You see these little kids, they're running all over the place. Their family can't, you know, oh, sit down, sit down. Oh, you, you can't do that. Johnny, don't. Johnny, please. But you spank his little behind or spank his hand a little bit. He start crying. He sit down and he calm down, you know, and that's just... That's just the way I grew up. I can't say that it's perfect. I can't say that it's the greatest thing in the world. But I can say that it seemingly worked. It worked. So you have to choose what works for you and your family. I didn't see anything obsessive in this video. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a link down in the description box for you to go and check out the video. Come back and tell me if you thought it was ex 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 if like he did something like he was trying to kill the child or, or he was doing something bad he wasn't hitting her in the face with the belt he wasn't he was in her butt and her legs and she had on jeans I mean Lord Jesus <laughs> anyway anyway uh, this is just my opinion you know if you want to hate Kate I don't care I know how I grew up and if I had children they would be disciplined there is no doubt about that um, all right take care peace I'm out Robert Anton